Hasio. Welcome to my DIY channel. I'm going to share with you today how to repair this water heater. First, open the casing by unscrew this small screw. Then it is good to go. Open up. Now guys, this is the water heater with a built-in pump. Water pump. This is the inflow and this is the water pump and this is the heating component this is the outflow the sound that you hear is because there's a piece of magnet built in in this pipe this area that will move up when the water flow pushes it to this area so it will go up and down up and down so when there's a water flow go up pushes this magnet into the higher position it will activate this switch this is called read switch and this activation switch will switch on the water pump and also the heating filament temporary power supply has been installed and we have to start troubleshooting and to test one by one first is the power supply area So there's no problem with the entrance of the power supply and this connector switch. So this part is okay. That means power is going in up to this part. Now the next thing is the uh, water heater filament, the heating filament, which is this part. So test two pole, light up. And the other pole down there, also light up is the read switch area this is the read switch and the magnetic components inside and the wiring let's test whether the wiring is working or not this is the wire now you see it is on so the wiring is okay but how about this read switch test this read switch you must simulate the normal uh, function action of the water heater which means the magnetic bar within this pipe has to be up so you may need to tilt the water heater like this to make sure the magnetic bar is on top by right when the magnetic bar is here already it should have activated the read switch here to power up the um, the motor pump and as well as the heating component and if this is working well by right the red led switch should be on i've identified the problems uh, uh, i i think it is either the red switch that is not working or the magnetic bar that is busted so how to know which one is which simple by getting an external magnet here and to put it near the red switch that conclude uh, when the magnet is near the read switch and it activate the pump and heating element means the read switch itself is normal but the internal magnet which is supposed to activate this read switch it is not working so we need to replace the magnetic bar inside this pipe to take out this pipe for you to access and replace the internal magnetic bar is a bit of job you need to release uh, the read switch, the anchor nut screw, and the clip here, and also release all the fire, all this electrical connection here. It all has been mobilized. It's a time to take out this pipe. There you go. It's out. Just to show you again, listen carefully the sound of the magnetic bar hitting it up and down. To extract the magnetic bar, as you can see, there is a there is a stop nut here that you need to take out. Well, the nearest thing that I can look for that will help me to push push the magnetic bar out by force is 
a paintbrush stick. I need to take out this segment which has enough length for me to use as a as a rigid bar that will be able to push through this hole and force the magnetic, magnetic bar out here. Now to cut the segment out, I need to use a cutter, heavy cutter like this. There you go. You should be able to do its job. Yes, all the way in. In ready, just gently pull it down. Out. This is the magnetic. It's out. Let's see. This is the magnetic bar that I'm talking about. It is malfunctioning. It's the old exhausted magnetic bar and this is a new one. New one. This is the old magnetic bar with the new magnetic bar installed and now it's in this position. Let's see whether I have fixed this water heater or not. By tilting the water heater, the new magnetic bar will go into this part and activate the red switch. If it is working, you would be able to hear the motor sound of the pump. There it goes. A little bit of a bonus, when you're installing the new magnetic bar into the pipe here, the direction has to be like this. Did you see the flow, laminar flow shape? Do not inversely install, otherwise the water won't flow. Don't put it like this. It should put it like this. Yeah? The water heater is good to go as brand new.